Why are you kissing me? <laughs> Why do you want to kiss me? Why do you want to give me kisses, huh? I love you too. <laughs> Hi everyone. Merry Christmas Eve. It is Christmas Eve. I can't believe it. Um, it's finally here. Yes, it is. And Mickey keeps wanting to kiss me. Let me kiss you. Let me kiss you. <laughs> let me kiss you. Yes, let me kiss you. Okay, so hopefully <laughs> everyone has their Christmas shopping done. What are you doing? What? You don't want me to record? You just want to play? You just want to play? Yeah. You just want to play? <laughs> Okay, sorry guys. All right, so today I wanted to share um, some more cards that we received since the last video and some more packages. Um, I'm sorry I haven't had many. <laughs> Why are you kissing me so much? Um, I'm sorry I haven't had many videos done, but if you remember um, in last week's video, I believe it was on Thursday, um, I still wasn't feeling well. I thought I was on the mend. Well, then I started doing too much stuff, I guess, and wasn't resting enough, and things just went downhill. Um, that weekend, I felt terrible. Um, it's just that time of year when you're around a bunch of people, I think, and the weather's been very mild. <laughs> so when it's when the weather changes like that, my sinuses and just things, I just I just get plugged up and just I don't feel well. It's actually supposed to be. Let me see here. Let's see what it's supposed to It's not going to be a white Christmas here in Michigan. No, it's not. It's going to be 50 degrees on Christmas here in Michigan. And then the day after Christmas, it's supposed to be 53 degrees. Uh, today it's only going to be 41, but yesterday and the day before, it was low 50s. And I actually saw people out in t-shirts. <laughs> Shopping in t-shirts, no coats, nothing. And I thought, um, there's going to be a lot of sick people here in Michigan um, thinking they can be out with t-shirts. Sorry, guys, they're playing on the floor here. Um, so, yeah, it's a, it's a very mild Christmas. And it's funny because Halloween here in Michigan, it was freezing and snowed that night. So it's warmer on Christmas than it was on Halloween. It's just crazy weather. So, anyways, let's get to the cards. Oh, I wanted to mention, too, um... I never mentioned about Mozzie's blood work. Um, remember, I had to take him back because the doctor was out sick when he went. So um, I had to take him the following week. He, she was out sick, and the text didn't run the blood work right. And if my tripod's wiggling, I'm sorry, the dog's over there. Come here, Magnum. Come here. <laughs> um, so they had to rerun it, and um, she cut his steroid back again. So we started out at 7.5 milligrams. Um, of prednisone and now we're we went back to five milligrams and now we're down to 2.5 So we're gonna see I've got to take him back the 30th uh, December 30th to get his blood work done again. So the saga the saga continues Mozzie's <laughs> blood work and getting his meds, right? So But we're just gonna keep doing what we got to do until we get everything perfect for him. So yeah, so he has cut back down on his um, steroid again, so let me get to the cards into the wonderful presents you guys have sent. What are you guys doing under there? What are you boys doing under there? <laughs> All right. So let's see. Let's see if I can get more of the dogs in the shot here. You guys are just chilling out here, chilling out on the bed. And then Mozzie over there is looking out the window, looking for squirrels, I think. Okay. Let me get my camera readjusted here. We watch these guys. And Emily, this blanket is so comfy. It is so soft. I love it. Thanks so much. Oh, also, Emily, tons of people want to know where you got the apron you sent me from. I'm thinking Amazon, but let us know in the comments down below. So for those who are looking for it. Okay, let's get on with the cards. This one was from the United Kingdom from Gem and Grace. And here's the cute, adorable card. And then here's a picture of, whoops, their baby. So cute. Thank you so much for the card. Appreciate it. And the picture. I love getting your uh, dog's pictures. Okay. This one is from Heidi and Merlin. Sorry. I'll get these cards in the, <laughs> in the frame here. I promise. 
Thank you so much. This one here is from Patty. Uh, let me see if I see, and this is Dublin. He is a Havanese mix, seven years old. Oh, there's a glare. Let's try to get, there we go. Thank you so much, cutie. Um, this one here is from Erin and her fur babies are named Grace, Kayla Jane, and then the other name I do not ha know how to pronounce. So I'm gonna just show it here on camera. It's right here. The one that starts with a C. I do not know how to pronounce that, so I'm not even gonna try and uh, butcher it. <laughs> here's the card. And then here's the picture of her fur babies. Also cute. Thank you so much. All right. Next we have, uh, this is Eilina, Daniel, Milo, Bella, and Luna. These babies are so adorable and you guys are adorable too. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Now we have, uh, this card is from Eve, Randy, Nick, and Radar. And they also sent me this cute magnet. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, next we have a card from Tammy, Bob, and Pippi, P-I-P-P-I. Thank you so much. All right, the next card is from Yoshi, Balto, Chip, and Evie. Look at those babies. Look at this one over here in the corner's ears. I love it. <laughs> love it. Thank you. All right, and then this card is from Ben, Debbie, and Candy Cane. I'm assuming Candy, Na Candy Cane is the name of your fur baby, and I'm assuming the name is Candy Cane due to maybe you got uh, your baby at Christmas time? Let us know in the comments. Thank you. All right, this next card is from Renee, Ricky, and Daisy May. So cute, and then here's Daisy May. So cute, look at that tongue. <laughs> no growling. <laughs> All right, sorry about that guys. My kids are making noise out there and the boys wanna know what's going on. <laughs> All right, this one is from Sarah and uh, she sent a picture of her dog Shep and, I'll, and uh, I don't know if it's, I think it's Lexi. Here's the card and then here's Shep and Lexi. And I'm assuming Shep is the shepherd and Lexi is the white dog. So cute. All right, that's it for cards. Thank you guys so, so much. Um, and then I got a package uh, from Chris, Mary, and Ariel. And they sent this cute little note. I'm gonna read it. It says, Dear Kim and the boys, uh, thank you so much for the hours of entertainment. The boys are so fun to watch and their unique personalities are the best. They bring so much joy to us all. I hope you enjoy this handmade ornament made by my mom, Mary. Have a wonderful Christmas with the family. Sincerely, Chris, Mary, and Ariel, the Schnelzer who will be 14 years old in March. And look at this awesome ornament that Mary made. Let's see if I can get it in the frame good and um, let you guys really see what a great job Mary did. Okay, here's Marley. This is all hand painted. Here's Milo and Max and Magnum and Mozzie, Miggy, Kitten and Merlin. Did you just hear my daughter scream? 
I think she's yelling at Merlin. <laughs> but isn't this ornament so cute? I love it so much. Thank you, Mary. You did such an awesome job. I just love it. Thank you. Okay. Now, Mickey, can you scoot over? Can you scoot over? Um, let's see here. Let me see if I can get myself in camera. I guess I don't care if I'm in camera. It's all about the boys, guys, right? It's all about the boys. Um, all right, this package is from, look at the boys getting nosy in there. It's from Debbie, Costello, and Maggie. Let me show you the pictures here. Here's Costello. And don't you growl. No, no. And here's Maggie. Magnum's growling. You hear him? <laughs> you better stop growling at your brother. Yes, you better. Oh, and I didn't show the card because it's really cute. Really cute. She sent some, yeah, this is why he's growling. Because there's some kitty treats in there. <laughs> kitty treats, no, no, watch out. And some doggy treats. These ones are from Bow Wow Bakery. Rain dog treats, chicken meatball um, dog treats. So they're growling uh, over these treats here. And then there's some Merry Christmas T-bone steak dog treats. And then the kitties got some more mouse toys to play with. And then here we have a couple ornaments for our schnauzer tree. I've already opened all these packages, you guys. Oh, Milo, no. <laughs> He's trying to get those dog treats. No, no. <laughs> um, thinking it might make my video go a little faster. I don't know. Me not. All right, now this ornament says, I suffer from multiple schnauzer syndrome. Um, Cause one schnauzer is never enough. Isn't that the truth? <laughs> Isn't that the truth? I have multiple schnauzer syndrome. So I have MSS. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. And then this one here, it's a schnauzer mom. Thank you so much. I really, it just blows me away. Um, everyone's kindness they show to me and the boys. Thank you so much for the gifts. I really appreciate it. Okay. Um, let me put this card with that box. All right. I'm trying not to show addresses, boys. Okay. This package is from Kelly. And here's her card here. Look at that sweetness. Okay. Um, Kelly sent this cute schnauzer stocking. Now this matches the ornament that I got. I believe it was from Emily. Look at this cute stocking. So this matches my ornament on my Christmas tree. So I need to go hang this out there in the schnauzer room on one of the uh, shelves there by the fireplace. Thank you so much. There's also, excuse me, there's also this cute Christmas ornament that reminds me of little Milo here. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Thank you so much, Kelly. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay. And then we got, Max, you went out? Let me let some of the boys out. They went out. You went out? Okay, go on, go see what's going on. Okay, they had to go see what was going on out there, you guys. Yes, they did. I'm, I apologize. Um, and then we've got a couple bags of treats from Linda, Chris, Kate, and Max in Canada. They sent these soft savories, chicken and yogurt. 
and these um, grain free soft baked beef uh, and sweet potato. So the boys are gonna love these. Thank you guys so much for the treats. The boys, I swear, they are stocked up for treats for a couple months, and that's wonderful. I won't have to buy any for a while. <laughs> Thank you guys. Okay, and then the last package is from, oh, let me see. Let me get myself back in camera since the boys are gone. Sorry guys, I'm trying to get this video done because I've got a lot of places to go. Um, and running around for dropping off gifts. So I'm, I'm trying to squeeze this video in so I can get a video out to you guys. This is from Sophia. Um, it says, Dear Schnauzer Mom, I'm a big fan of your YouTube channel. I love your videos. Thank you for sharing um, your life with us. Your life with the six, six Schnauzers with us. I also had a Schnauzer, but he passed away. When I watch your video, when I watch your videos, it brings back all the good memories that I had with my Schnauzer. I am an artist and I love to draw animals. I wanted to share some of my art and designs with you. I hope you like it. I wish you and your family a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, Sophia. Now I'm thinking she designed this card, which is so cute. And then she also sent, I don't have them both put together, but she sent these beautiful schnauzer pillows. So I'm assuming she designed this schnauzer and had it printed on the pillow. I'm not totally for sure. So Sophia, if you're watching, please comment down below. I'm thinking you designed this pillow and had it printed out. I don't know if you sell them, so you'll have to let us know because it's so cute. Um, and then there's this one here. I haven't taken this one out yet. Let me get it out. Comes with the pillow and then this pillowcase here. You stuff the pillow in. Isn't it adorable? After I get all my Christmas stuff down, this is going on my two chairs in the schnauzer room. Um, and then she also painted this wonderful picture. Isn't this just cute? Thank you so much, Sophia. I really appreciate it. You did an awesome job, I love it. Thank you so much for the gifts. Okay, let me put this back in here. Magnum's out there barking. I don't know what he's barking at. Well, he barked once, so must not have been it. Oh, there were stickers, oh, they fell. There were stickers in my card too. I don't know if she designed these stickers as well. Like I said, please let us know in the comments. Okay. And then we got a package from um, Marilyn. Marilyn watches the channel. Oh, I gotta scoot up. She watches our channel. And they also own, her and her husband own a company that makes the winter, uh, dog boots and some other products. Um, I did a video reviewing the uh, dog boots. If you remember, we had that um, like Arctic blast where it was like negative, what was it? Like negative 30s? I can't remember, it was cold. The real feel was like negative 20s, 30s, I can't even remember. It was just cold and I was having a problem with um, the boys with their paws. It was hard for them to go outside because it was so cold. Um, and she graciously sent some um, some uh, dog boots for the boys. And it's uh, their company is called Paw Tracks Pet Gear. So she sent um, a pair of dog boots uh, to give away. And then she also sent um, a couple different products. Um, one is called uh, Tag uh, it's a tag wallet and then a tag bag. So for your dog's tags that hang on the collar, there's one, the wallet, you connect, there's a ring on the inside of the wallet, you connect the tags to it, tuck um, the tags in, Velcro it shut, I believe, let me open it. Yeah, my dogs are barking. I don't know what they're barking at. Yeah, Velcro shut. So on the inside, there's a little ring on this little loop 
and you put your dog's tags on it, tuck them in, Velcro it shut, and then there's this little elastic, and you put it right on their dog collar. And then your dog's collars, um, they were saying in the note that they sent that sometimes some tags are made of cheap metal and it can stain the fur. Um, and this will also keep your dog's tags quiet um, so they're not banging around. Because you remember, I took my dog's um, rabies license off of their collar because they would bang and bang and bang. And they'd also rub together and it would rub off the information on the tags because they were rubbing constantly. So this one just goes right on their dog collar. And then this one here, let me get this one out. Oh, jeez. Okay, this one comes with like a little ring and then it has these little eyelets on it. So on the instructions, it says to put the ring through one of the eyelets, attach the dog tags, and then put and then close it with the um, through the other eyelet, and then your dog's tags just and then you attach this to the collar, so they would hang like this, and this will keep them quiet and keep them from staining. So there's two different styles. Now I'm thinking the style. Um, let me put this back because I don't want anything to get lost because I'm gonna give these away. I'm gonna have a giveaway. Um, I'm thinking the style I would prefer, um, they made two different styles because some people preferred the others, one over the other. They said this is their best sellers. Um, I think these ones that would connect to their collar would be wonderful because if your dog, um, like when you're, if you keep your dogs in crates when you're away from the house like I am, um, when I leave, I put them in their crates and at night they stay in their crates. Um, and sometimes I worry because what if the tags get caught in the wire of the crate? What if your dog gets loose and they're rummaging through whatever and their tags get caught and then get pulled off um, and then their tags are gone. So if anybody finds them, if your dog's not microchipped, which you should get your dog microchipped, but if they're not and their tags rip off, no one can um, will have your information. So. If this is connected right to your dog's collar, there's no chance really, or less chance of them getting ripped off the collar. So I think I would prefer this one myself over the other, but everybody, like they said, has their preference of what style they like. So yes, we're gonna do a giveaway. So, all right guys, sorry I had to splice the video. The boys wanted back in the room and they were clawing at my door. <laughs> So, like I said, we're gonna have a giveaway. Um, so if you want to win the doggy boots or um, the, uh, and I'm, I apologize, someone is next door now blowing leaves in the yard. So I apologize if you can hear that. Um, so if you wanna win, we're gonna have, um, I'm gonna draw six names. So first place is gonna be for the um, winter, boots and either the tag wallet or the tag bag um, and then we're going to draw a second third fourth and fifth place let me make sure i'm getting that right yes second third fourth and fifth place to win either the tag bag or the wallet i'll just pick what i send you randomly um so we're going to pick six names total first place is going to be the boots and one of the tag bags or tag wallets. So um, just enter um, down below in the comments. Please enter me and you'll be entered for the giveaway. I'm gonna announce the winner on January 1st because I'm planning on taking some time off from doing videos. I may um, try to videotape them tomorrow on Christmas. Um, they don't open presents, I put their uh, toys in a gift bag and I put their treats in a gift bag because my boys do not open presents um, they don't open wrapping paper like some dogs do so they just have gift bags so and the cats have their own gift bag with their treats and toys so I'll try to get some video of them checking out their presents and maybe playing with them and upload that video but after that I will not have a video again until January 1st and that's when we will announce the winners of the prizes so I will also have their website linked down below if you'd like to check them out they also um, 
are offering a discount if you would like to purchase the um, either the tag bag or the tag wallet. If you enter the code Milo, M-I-L-O, you will receive a 15% off discount. Um, if you go to their website and are interested in the um, dog boots, if you enter the code Schnauzer, you will get 10% off of that product so their website is called pawtrackspetgear.com and I will have that um, down below in the description of the video if you want to click on that link and go over there and check out they have other products too um, and like I said too I'll also have the video linked down below in the description where I reviewed um, their dog boots and I'm going to tell you I did two um, reviews last year on pet boots. I did their pet boots and I also did a um, some pet boots called walkie paws. They're a totally different style than these um, and I'm going to tell you now having them for um, almost a year now and using them I prefer their pet boots <laughs> over the walkie paws. The walkie paws are still a great product but I noticed while using them that if you don't have the walkie paws adjusted, I'll link that video down below too so you can kind of see what, I, um, what I'm talking about. Um, the walkie paws go on totally different. If you don't have them adjusted just right, um, the dog's leg can come right out of them. And in these ones, I've never had a problem with the boys getting these boots off of their feet. So. I prefer these over the others because um, I know someone sent me a message asking me that question which one I preferred and I prefer these ones over the others so I'll have both those links you can check them both out and see which style you'd like but um but I will have their website down below um, and I'll have the coupon codes down below um, so yeah so I hope everyone has a great Christmas um, and a happy new year. <laughs> like I said, I'll try to get video of them, open their gifts. Um, but I want to thank everyone this past year um, for supporting our channel, those who have sent gifts, um, those who have sent donations for their emergency fund. I appreciate you all and I'm looking forward to having a another wonderful year with the boys and sharing them with you guys. And um, and just again, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. So we'll see you in the next video. Merry Christmas. Bye.